Welcome back to this channel for practice problems for actuarial exams. My name is Krzysztof Ostaszewski. You can find information about me at smarturl.it forward slash Jedi. My advice on how to pass actuarial exams is at smarturl.it forward slash pass. This video channel is at smarturl.it forward slash pass actuarial exams. Here you have information about online seminars. Uh, and study manuals for exams PFM, IFM, and LTIM that I offer. I direct the actuarial program at Illinois State University. You can find information about it at smarturl.it forward slash actuary. If you would like to offer a tax-deductible donation to support our students, please go to smarturl.it forward slash help ISU actuary. Here's a problem for today. For exam IFM, Investments and Financial Markets, the current price of a stock is 80. Both call and put options on this stock are available for purchase at a strike price of 65. Determine which of the following statements about these options is true. Both the call and put options are at the money. Both the call and put options are in the money. Both the call and put options are out of the money. The call options in the money, but the put options out of the money and the call options out of the money, but the put options in the money. And here's the solution. The current stock price, 80, is higher than the strike price, which is 65. This means that a call giving the right to buy the stock at the price of 65 has an intrinsic value of 15. That's the value um, that you would get if you were able to exercise the, the option immediately. And it is in the money. That you, in the money means that you can get money out of exercise of the option, that there is a payoff, positive payoff, if the option were to be exercised immediately. The put, giving the right to sell the stock at the price of 65, um, has no intrinsic value because the stock can be sold in the market for $80, so why in the world would you want to sell it for less? Uh, we also note that the strike price is below the current price of the stock, so we will say that the options mm, at the money if the two prices, the current price in the market for the underlying and the strike price of the option are equal, but it's not the case here. The strike price is well below the current price of the stock, and that means that the put is out of the money. And that's answer D. Please remember this is copyrighted material. The problem itself belongs to the Society of Actuaries. The solution is mine. Good luck in your studies and good luck on the test.